Yo guys, Ollie Tatia, and today we are back with another episode of Life is Strange True Colors. This is going to be episode 3. We're just going to get straight back into the game. Uh, where we left off, I think we're going to find Ethan in the mines. Because uh, we lied about not knowing where he is, but then we we, re we revealed that we knew. I, d I didn't get the choice to either continue to keep it a secret or reveal. We, we just revealed that we knew where we were and we were lying, which is a bit, you know. But hopefully we find him. I mean, as soon as he was about six. It'd be pretty dark if he just he, he just died, but... But, yeah. Oh, this could be like druggies or monsters in there or something. And obviously we've we've now told Gabe about our power, uh, and he believes us, which is good. Come on, pick up, pick up. He's not gonna die, is he, man? Better not. We're going to get attacked by rabid rats or something. Wow. Been a while since I was up here. How worried should we be? Uh, should I be... I don't know. Freaking out right now? This is the thing that got me with the uh, Last Stop, no, another game on the Xbox Game no, Pass. Uh, I wanted to play it for a video, but I'd already played through it and... Would have got bored if I played through it again. In that game, the dialogue options just completely didn't relate to what the character actually said. Like the answer would be like, "Oh, I don't know," but the thing would be like, "I want chocolate for breakfast or something." Like it would just be completely unrelated. That's that's not an like, accurate example, but it just wouldn't be related to the dialogue options whatsoever. Or the actual outcome of the dialogue. Whereas th this it's game, it's at least relevant. Can you imagine the shit we would have caught from Dad if we'd done anything like this? I should have said something earlier. I didn't. I mean, when he said he was going to the old mine... Alex, it's fine. You couldn't have known. <laughs> yeah, I, I definitely couldn't have known. Yeah, yeah. I, I, I just didn't know. I'm gonna go take a look around. Let me know if you spot any sign of Ethan. Sure. It's this, it's, surely this isn't the bit where, you know, it. surely not this early. How was Ethan planning to get into the mine? Probably through the door. Safety poster. Nope. 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 Super nope. <laughs> That's always brilliant. There's a, there's, a, there's a zombie here. How I don't think it's a real zombie. zombie. The least creepy thing out here. Uh, keg. The real monster here is underage drinking. Hey, bro. Want to get wasted at the old mine? Pneumatic pickaxe. Until you're up close. But mining equipment is super murdery. My joyride in this will have to wait until after we found Ethan. Yeah, it's a good job, like, um, this this place is super secure and no one can actually just break in and access the mines. Okay, so they're both nervous. Alex, why? Why didn't you? No point in blaming anyone. We just gotta find him. Fast. He's right. The only thing that matters now is finding Ethan. Come on, Ryan. Everyone is depending on you. Ryan won't let his fear get in the way. I'm glad he's here. Oh, that's um weird. What happened here? Massive cave in. A bunch of trapped miners. All nearly died. Jed led the whole team back to the surface. God. Yeah, that's the day Foreman Jed became local hero Jed. And then Typhon closed up this site, basically bought Jed the Black Lantern. I think I'm starting to remember a bit more of the story now from the bits I watched. Oh, 
Ah, clever. Same logo. Did Ethan base his comic on this place? The tunnel to the monster stronghold of Demonheim, Demonheim collapsed. Okay. I have to find another way in. Okay. The uniform of the city guard, long dead from the looks of it. Blood. This trail seems to end here, useless. Hongo. Hang on, what? So there should just be a gate to the right of us. Maybe we should notice anything? No shit. I'll be damned. The whole story is about Ethan's character breaking into a monster story. Oh, so this is like his magnum opus. This is what he's been building up to. Does it show where he went? Not sure. The comic ends with the monster hunter climbing a watchtower, which shows him where to go. There. The silo. Uh. I bet that's the tower. That's where he went. You're a genius. Yeah. I am, yeah. You find, Alex? Gabe, you want to take a crack at unlocking that gate? I'm on it. We should also be able to get to it through the processing building. If we can find a way in. Yeah, the, the, the processing building. I should compare his drawings with other stuff in the area. I think I'm looking for something closer to that big building. I think Thanor went a different way. What's he thinking now? Oh, same thing. Why didn't you? No point blaming anyone. Too bad nothing like this is in the comics. Thanor could have just plowed through the entrance. Oh, we found it. It's the open gate. Wait, so did Ethan? Oh man. I don't follow. I think there's like a side door back there. I don't know. I guess there might be. Give me a hand. Oh, so why do people in this... Surely this is setting like... A bit more recently than haven't used lanterns instead of just normal torches. You figured that out from the comic book. Yes. Definitely didn't just go around spamming air on every single thing. Did you get your checks? Yeah, yeah I did. I did actually. Something's got to go wrong, doesn't it, to make the game interesting? Like, we're not just going to find him, go back home, and everything's going to be dandy. That, that's just not what's going to happen, is it? How did he get out? Weed. Legalize it. Have I got some good news for you? Ooh. It, it was, was four twenty uh, a couple of years ago. What? Kind of want to push all the buttons. Also. Kinda scared to push any of the buttons. Yeah, that looks about right. Must have gone upstairs. That was 420 a couple of days ago. Sure Ethan climbed these I, I didn't realise. Pe loads of people went to Hyde Park and it was actually just legal there at smoke. Like, there was police there and it was just chill. Like, there was stands and that for, for it and everything. I didn't realise that. It's quite cool. It's like the Purge book for Ganja instead of murder and crime. One day you can just all gather up and get totally blit piffed, dude. That's not the word, it is it? In the comic. Right, sorry, I'm just trying. Caution when ascending. Caution, like an hour. Ago. Yep, something's gonna go wrong, isn't it? It's a good job anyway, because I didn't fancy jumping that. Is it? Is it going to be the window? Don't you open up that window? Oh, it's cracked. The silo. We're getting close. 
Wait, that's a conveyor belt, not a path. Real this Ethan bloke is mental, not bloke, but you know. Jesus Christ. This kid is he's like eight, but Jesus Christ. Enough. Like, look at that. Look at that top picture. We're just meant to sprint across there. Really. Ethan made the jump from here to the conveyor belt. Oof. I think I'll find another way through. This kid mental, I tell you. Looks like Ethan climbed the conveyor belt out to the silo. Yikes! Yikes! Indeed. Maybe there's some way to open the door. Ninety ninety five, does that say? Nine five four. Yeah, what's the plan then? That says nine five something. That says nine five four, definitely. Ah. Heads up. Oh, there we go. Big brain. Big brain Alex. You figured out the door. Yeah. Right. Where's out where's gear about? Where's gear about? Could probably deal with this help and he's been missing for, he's been gone for quite a while now. Which I'm not entirely happy with, if I'm honest. Well, I said death there, and I was like, well, no, I'm, I'm not going to go there, am I? How do I get back down? Not there, is it? No. Uh, we're around here then, won't it? Yeah, if someone dies from this, which I'm pretty sure the. Oh. Ugh. Let's hope omens aren't really a thing. Yeah, let's. It's like all the ones man next on. I'm just gonna trod on it. Yes. It's like the ones on. All the ones my next door neighbor's cat leaves for us. All the dead birds and that. But. Yeah, if someone dies from this, we're putting the entire blame on Ethan. Right, he is getting grounded for a decade. At least. So you never forget how to break a lock. It's like riding a bike. Where to next, Alex? Well, the silo. Right, come on. Well, I'm assuming we can go up that other way. Oh. Oh, it could see. That went black, that means something big's gonna happen. Thanor looks out from the watchtower and spots the secret entrance to the stronghold. Oh, but he's not even here, we're just looking at the... Just... We're just trying to find the way to the thing. There. That's where he's heading. That's by the ravine. Shit. Oh, Christ. Let's go. If playing Minecraft taught me anything, don't go near ravines. Especially if you're eight years old. Well, n n Minecraft didn't teach me about eight, being eight years old, but... Y you know, it's, ravines are quite dangerous, especially if they're hidden. Uh, this is... It's gonna go wrong, isn't it? <laughs> Slight suspicion that it's gonna go wrong. Here we go. Think so. Oh. Ethan. 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 He's not just gonna be like, oh yeah, yeah, it's me. I, I, I'm, I'm here. I'm here. 
Or purple rock. Like amethyst or something. Amethyst is purple, isn't it? Yeah. Or is that his aura? Oh, Christ. Christ. Ha ha what? You should be! Not Gabe, 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 Gabe. Ethan? You okay? No, just tell him to find another way around. Just find another way around. Why are you going across? That means we need two people back. Just, if he dies, he dies, innit? Don't look at me! Don't look at me! Shit. What about me? No! Uh, are you sure? No, I'm not sure! Just tell him to come back the way... Ethan's the lightest! And that means we only need to make one trip instead of going there and coming back. And he just needs to come back. Remember? Don't these people think! Yeah, yeah, we'll be fine. We'll be fine. Yeah, I'm all right. <sighs> Are you sure? It's okay if you're not. No, I'm good. No. Why didn't Ethan just come back? We tossed the rope to him. Toss it across. I mean, Alex, Christ alive. Make eye contact with me. I'm gonna tie this rope around your waist. The other end is tied around your brother. Oh, Christ. That stump is a fulcrum. The feed rope, your direction. Follow? So far. Awesome. You're doing super good. Remember, slow is steady. This is why I'm not an adventurous type and I don't go outside or touch grass. Because that this can happen. And also, like, you can't get... I was going to say you can't get non-star that out inside. You can on, like... Like... Twitter and that, but just, like, don't, don't go on it then. Oh, dear. I feel like there's going to be a quick time event, isn't there? Hang on, Ethan. I'm coming. Oh, there was one game where there was like a quick time event, but no matter how quick your reactions are. I'm not going back without you. No matter how quick your reactions are, you just weren't allowed to get it off. Oh, I, forgot, I forgot what game it was. Might have been Minecraft Story Mode, yeah, I think it was. Great, now there's two people on the other side of the river. Right, crying isn't going to get the job done, is it? Focus. Talk to me. You want to tell me how you got out here? I was trying to cross to the other side. The log fell. Ah. That's fine. That's okay. Let's talk about what comes next. Right. Gabe's got us. We're not going to fall. He's got the other end of the rope. No. I can't move if I move. You're not gonna fall, buddy. It doesn't matter. Yes, it does. He's not making any sense. Mate, mate, mate. Yeah. Wait, listen, you stupid git. Stay here, Ethan. We have to. It'll see me. If I move, it'll see me. What's gonna see you? You don't understand. He's right. that's, that's one of my favorite Juice Lord songs. I 
can't help him. What it? What's going to see him? You know, life is strange. One, there wasn't exactly any like zombies or monsters or anything. I mean, Mr. Jefferson was a monster. Sorry, spoilers. Uh, but not in that sense. And if I don't uh, understand or is he just in his head that much about uh, the comics? Like, he thinks the monsters and villains in the comics are real. Grab the stupid kid and run. I can do this. I can do this. Well, if we absorb the fear out of him or something, can we do that? Monster? What monster? No one told me about any monster. I'm not just feeling what Ethan feels. I'm seeing the world like he sees it. I brought all this stuff. None of it will save me. The only thing that can save you is yourself, Ethan. And you need to book your ideas up and get out of here. Yes, it's real. And if you don't move, you okay. will die. He's not afraid of the fall. He's afraid of Oh. Oh shit. Can't let it see me. Can't let it see me. It can't be real. Oh, but it looks pretty fucking real. But it's not though. It's inside his head. Just tell him to stop being so daft and to peg it. Get on with it! As long as you're touching me, you're safe. Could have worded that better, but we move. Well in our kid. Don't look down, okay? We'll be done before you know it. Just get it over with, man. Just go. Monster. Monster isn't real. It's, it's just not real, though, is it? Alex? Yeah, but what? What now? I'm still really scared. Shut up and go, okay? There's nothing to be afraid of. I got you. But what if you let go? Shit. What do you mean? I'm not going to let go, though. Do you think the log will break? No. Not unless we move. It would have been far easier if he just died, you know, if he just fell, or, you know, didn't go out there in the first place. Do you reckon if we t if we told them about Ethan in the first place, we would have got him earlier? We're fine. We're fine. We're fine. So you just jump for it at that point. That's it. Come on. Let me go. I got you. Oh, 
go. Nice. I mean, we've passed out, but you know, we did it. <laughs> well, no, it's it's funny now, apparently. Don't. That's a, that's a dangerous camera angle. Don't, 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 don't. Oh man. I mean, Ryan did what he had to do, but he's a dickhead for that as well. Thank you for the achievement. That's only chapter one. There's, okay, so we know there's chapters now. Damn. Oh, so it was very... We've, we've got our choices now, which is good. So, it, it was very split whether telling about Ethan or not. Uh, we were in the minority of staying out of, out of Max fight. And... We we're, were in the majority about telling Gabe about our power. 96% people hugged Gabe, obviously. I just encouraged Riley to be honest. We're in the majority. Alex didn't interact with the norm. What norm? We're, somehow we're in the minority for that. Alex didn't stop at the listening station. Okay, we're in the minority there. Alex told Ryan that Gabe was a badass. Yeah, okay, we're in the majority. M my majority, <laughs> yep. Majority. Alex walked out with Gabe on the broom guitar. Yeah, 95%. Even though it was funny because there wasn't any music. Alex found evidence of Gabe's search for her. 94%. There's three choice one. Alex expressed optimism about heaven, Haven, Charlotte. Alex expressed pessimism about Haven. Okay, so we're, so we're in the minority out of three for that one. Uh, well, it, we didn't have a good start, to be fair. I mean, we listened, we danced with no music, and we assaulted a man. So it wasn't exactly the best to start. Uh, Alex told Jed she's never been a server. Okay, so only 52% of people were on the side, which is quite surprising. Now, Alex told Gabe she loves the guitar. 97%, that's the biggest choice made so far. And Jed was impressed with Alex's performance as a server, 88%. 2% of people just did awfully as a server. And Jed figured out Alex had never been a server before. Okay, so that's if you lied to him. Uh, or went along with Gabe's lie. Alex didn't didn't play the jukebox game with Steph. I didn't know there was a jukebox game. Oh, that, that's if we sat down and talked to her, but we just went, now we've got work in it. Riley and Mac are still together. We're in minority... I'm I'm a relationship saver. If you need relationship advice, come to me. Um, because I'm I'm so experienced in that department, honestly. Uh, and Ducky was reunited with his favourite whiskey. Not nine percent of people just suck at the game, apparently. Uh, none of you. Okay. Uh, so it's a bit of a shorter episode than I liked. Barely even reaching half an hour, but it's the end of chapter one, so I mean, it's a good place to stop. Uh, yeah. I'm assuming there's five episodes, right? Because that's normal for a game. I mean, Minecraft Story Mode started with five episodes. It went to eight, but it was five. Life is Strange 1 was five episodes. I think Life is Strange 2 was five episodes. Okay, yeah, so... That is going to be the end of today's video. If you guys did enjoy it, be sure to drop a like, comment, and subscribe. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.